Daster131 here. Today we're gonna be telling you why you shouldn't buy the Quest 3S or the Meta Quest 3S or the Oculus Quest 3S. It is a waste of money. It's basically supposed to replace the Quest 2, right? But it has the same specs as the Quest 3. Has a lower has a lower display, like resolution. I just saw it, the a video of, of of Oculus or Meta upload a video of, of showing the Quest 3 S. Now, I'm not gonna show you what it looks like, you guys probably seen it, but, I, right, I, what I have over there, like what I have down there, like over there is my Quest 3 charging. You should buy that device. Buy that device. Do not buy the Quest 3 S. Buy the Quest 3. The Quest 3 is supposed to replace the Quest 2, which I have over there. I haven't used it in a while, but it's supposed to replace that unit. It's not the other way around, where you make a, a, a Quest 3 and then you make Quest 3S. Do not buy the Quest 3S, I'm telling you. Buy the Quest, buy the Quest 3 normal version. It's a lot better, has a higher screen resolution. Overall, it's thinner too. It is still heavy because everything's in the front, but you could easily use third-party straps and, and and strap a battery back here. Um, buy a Quest 3. Don't buy a Quest 3S. Screw you, Meta, for doing this type of decision. And also, off topic, make more MMORPGs. Get more AAA developers to make MMORPGs. Get get all types of developers to make all MMORPGs or any type of popular game that's out because people are leaving the VR space. But yeah, make a Sword Art Online for crying out loud, an official one. Work with Bandai Namco to port Sword Art Online Integral Factor to the Oculus Store. Alright? And also, why don't you make one yourself instead of having to buy out a company? VR Chat developers, Ergus, is making a Project Eingrad and I played the level update in ba when it was in beta. For crying out loud, make a VR MORPG and get Square Enix and Blizzard to, to, to port their games over. Not through mods, no, officially. That's a 131 signing off.